any spell that is upon Nigeria, we command it to be broken. Any spell that is on Nigerians, spell, witchcraft spell. We know the peoples in high places of authority, they go to any extent. They can rent herbalists inside the aircraft, move around, and cast the spell on the whole nation. Oh, yeah. When it is time either to vote or for, let them not know what they are voting. People will be campaigning for almost demons and will almost want to kill themselves for a person who doesn't care for them. That's a charm. Somebody hands over himself as a thug, ready to receive the bullet for the person who doesn't care for his survivor. That's a charm. People will be arguing over the man who has sold their life and destiny. You don't know the extent to which this nation is indebted. You need to find out. The destiny of future generation mortgaged. And people are, will be arguing. They don't care a damn whether you live or die. And then another charm is charm to be patient in suffering. No fuel, you are patient. Nothing, you are normal. No light, you are normal. No school, you are normal. Every day you go to the market, the price is on the increase. You are normal. If it's charm, it's spoil. There are places in this country you can't travel by road, you can't travel by air, you, you can't travel by train. Airport was attacked, train was attacked, road, demons on the road. People are normal. It's normal. Capture somebody, bring 20 million, bring 50 million. They go and look for money to pay. Everybody is still normal. If it is charm, won't it spoil? They're just patient, just go, just go. Just, just, struggle. And at times, the survival of Nigerians is a miracle. Somebody has a salary of 30,000 a month. And transportation is... is, is And he's surviving. Father, any spell cast on Nigeria, whether it is a charm, let it spoil. Let people say, enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. You have killed us enough. You have suffered people enough. People have struggled enough. Find your level. Let us find our level. us were born into this country nobody own it more than another whether you are president or governor you don't own it more than another person you don't have any right to it more than another person that is what we're about to pray now any charm on this nation let it spoil any spell let the eyes of people open They beat you with cane. They say, don't cry. Pa, 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 pa. Keep quiet. Like that wicked fat old man in the village gives a knock to the small child and hold the hand. Don't rub the knock. Let the knock assimilate. Pure wickedness. Be suffering, but don't, don't say anything. 
be in affliction but don't complain even a blind man knows that something is wrong even those in places of authority should confess that they failed that this is total blatant failure that you met something you are, you, 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 something is worse than how you met it is that success Lift up your hands and your voice and say, Father. Father. Say it louder. Say, Father. Father. Today, today we, ask we ask that every spell, that every spell cast, on cast on Nigeria and on Nigerians, and on Nigerians to, to make them, to make them suffer, suffer without complaint. Without complaint. Let, it Let it spoil. Anywhere you are watching from all around the world or around this country, this prayer is a prayer to keep on playing. Pray. Lift your hands, say, Father, Father any witchcraft spell, any, witchcraft spell any, national any national bewitchment, any national bewitchment, any national bewitchment on the nation of Nigeria, the nation of Nigeria that is causing the people not to see the calamity and the disaster that they are in, that they are experiencing, that they are enduring. Father, let the spell pray, let the charm spoil now. Open your mouth and pray.